Hi, Tori Eisenman with Benchmark Real Estate Group, and we're at Matthews Hope with Scott Blue. And on November 10th, you got something big going on. We do. It's uh, it's our annual garden party. Uh, it happens on the second Saturday every year. Uh, this year it will be held, and for the for as long as I'm alive, it's going to be held at the Pines of uh, Windermere, and uh, it's called the Matthews Hope Harvest of Hope Garden Party. And we used to actually have it next door to our uh, aquaponics and aeroponics garden. Uh, we had a chemical-free garden, and so we kept that theme that we're actually taking inside. So we're actually going to have a tent inside a building <laughs> so we can enjoy the air conditioning and women can wear high heels. That's the whole that's purpose nice. of it. Because that's, like sinking that's in an the important dirt. thing. Yeah, <laughs> high heels are an important thing, especially if you're having a fundraiser. Uh, but eat, what's very cool about it is each table has its own theme. And so we've seen everything from Alice in Wonderland. Florida Hospital did an amazing job last year with Alice in Wonderland. Another group did steampunk. Another one was the, uh, they were the under, uh, they were in the witness prote protection program. So all the women and all the men all had mustaches <laughs> and these really cool trench coat outfits. Um, so everyone has their own theme, but uh, it's very cool. Scott Maxwell from the Orlando Sentinel is our MC, And this year we're having dueling pianos as our, uh, as our, um, entertainment and uh, we're real excited about it. It's a lot of fun. You can either buy an individual ticket for $75 and that will include your catered meal uh, or you can buy a table uh, uh, for 10 for $500 and, and that includes nothing but the table but you either bring your own food or you use one of our per preferred caterers and then it goes up from there. We have sponsorships that go up to $10,000. So feel free if you really want to write the big check. We got we got something for you, but we have something for everybody. It's a good night. So you talk about writing a big check. You know, some people may not know what Matthew's Hope is. We probably should have talked about that. And, uh, and the thing about Matthew's Hope, we're a homeless outreach based in West Orange County. And uh, we have everything from our own Montessori preschool called the Firm Foundation Preschool to 13 transitional homes in the community. Uh, to a wood shop that we custom build furniture called the Hope Chest and we custom build and restore furniture out there. Uh, we have a nurse on staff, a social worker uh, and the, the, probably the most significant thing and why the, the fundraiser is so important is that we don't take any government funding. We're completely supported uh, by the community to the tune of about a hundred thousand a month is what we need to raise. Uh, last year it took uh, uh, about a million dollars in cash and 2.5 million and goods and services that was everything from medical to education to uh, veterans housing to you name it. So the one thing I love about Matthew's Hope that I think is a little bit different than some of the other outreach programs that I've seen or been aware of is you're not just trying to get people off the street and then they're going back. I think that's really what separates us from most is, is most and this is not to sound critical uh, but most of the organizations out there don't really have an end game uh, they, they got some great teaching, don't get me wrong, they teach people about um, uh, uh, health and they teach people about, edu you know, about getting an education and they teach people finance and what have you. But when you graduate, you basically get a certificate and you're right back to where you started. You just know more about why you're there. Uh, our goal is to move you towards independence and self-sustainability. And that could be different from everyone. Uh, we don't treat the symptom, we try to get to the core. Uh, what created the situation? What happened in this person's life that made it okay to live like this? And so once we get to the core, rather than handing you a tissue over and over again, we try to find out why are you sniffling? Is it a cold? Is it an allergy? Is it uh, you got a cocaine habit like I did? Um, what is going on there? And, and then we approach it from that way. So rather than hurt everybody in the same group, it's like, you know, we're going to treat a veteran not differently, but treat the veteran's needs. We're going to treat the person with mental health issues not differently, but what are their needs? The man that lost his wife, not differently, and it goes right on through that. The person who lost their job. We try to look at all those different things and then treat them as an individual and, and if you will, uh, work their case. I hate using that terminology, but work their case specifically towards them and yet having the same outcome desired, which is to create independence and self-sustainability. So, which is awesome because I can go watch a video on snow skiing and that doesn't mean I can get on a set of skis and ski down that slope. <laughs> you can try, so. <laughs> yeah. It may work out, it may not. Sometimes I went really fast down and didn't know if I was going to live. So I think the fact that you, you've got this application process, I mean, you're, you're helping people build things, you're yeah. creating jobs. I mean, it's amazing what you're doing. So to be able to go to a party, right, have fun and donate money at the same time. So we're November 10th? November 10th. 
uh, at the Pines of Windermere. If you're interested in getting tickets, you can visit our website at matthewsoapministries.org or you can call our office at 407-905-9500. Um, if you, you tell us what you're interested in, or you can look at, like I said, on the website and see the different uh, tables and sponsorships available, and we'd love to have you. I mean, everybody is welcome. It's a great night. It's a very eclectic group of people. Uh, the tables are fun. The entertainment's fun. And we also make it a point to kind of share where we've been, where we're going, and you'll actually hear from uh, some of our, we refer to everybody as a guest. They're not homeless. They're structurally challenged. And, uh, and you will hear from some of them as well as they share their story because nothing is more impactful than their story. For me to tell their story is one thing. For them to tell their story is completely different. And, and we've got some great stories for this year. So if you're out there and you want to go to a great party, help support a great nonprofit, um, go to the garden party. And thank you so much for what you're doing. We'd love to have you. Thank you.